Hey y'all, Bro Girl here. Today we're going to be replacing the burners in a Brinkman Pro Series 2400. I've already taken out the cooking grids and the heat plates, and so when you open up your grill and remove those, this might be what you're looking at. Now a lot of this rust down here is actually falling off from your heat plates, but some of it is coming off of your burners. And uh, people ask me, when do you know it's time to replace your burners? Well, these burners are a real type. They're made out of cast iron, and so they are rusting. Cast iron rusts, that's just a part of what it does, but at the point that they're starting to flake off and you can break them apart with your fingers like that, probably time to replace them. So you can just remove all of this down here and toss it. It's not hard to do, and it'll really make your grill look a lot nicer. All right, so I went ahead and replaced this burner right off the bat. Um, the first thing I had to do was remove the hitch pin, which is a little pin that holds the burner into this burner bracket right here, and you wanna pull that out. It can be kind of a pain, so just be prepared. Maybe some pliers would help. And once you pull that out, this is loose, and you can lift it up off the burner bracket. Now, because of the way that these burners are hooked into the front of the grill, there's two sheets of sheet metal that they have to come through. You really just pretty much have to pull to get them out. But remember, this is your grill, and it's not that fragile, so go ahead and use a little bit of force. So here's my new burner. Um, here's the hitch pin again. And this is the little nub that goes in the hole right here. So now it's just the opposite of what I just did. You just have to put it in here. You've got to feed it through both sets of sheet metal. And then again, it's just a little bit of force to get it in there. You want to take your hitch pin, put it through the little nub here at the bottom. And now your burner is set in there. So that's replacing the burners on your Brinkman Pro Series 2400. And that would apply again to any kind of grill that uses a rail cast iron burner.